Okay. There's a question on YouTube on uh, how to finish some of these uh, metal appliances. So I'm going to do a few of these here, just to kind of show you what I do. Uh, first off, this is how I take them off the model. This is how they come to the uh, the uh, my acrylic guy, who also does our metal work. But what I do is I break these off. That's the best way to save the band. These bands are kind of flimsy. And they'll tend to collapse on you if you try to, you know, force it off. And what I'm doing is just gently twisting. Oh, that came out without having to without the tooth. Usually they come out with the tooth. There we go. Just be gentle and remove some. I need to remove some stone. Sometimes they get a little trapped in there. There we go. So that one, as you can see, came out pretty cleanly. These other ones, these RPEs, the teeth are still in there. Now the fastest way to get the teeth out is I'll have to use this 330 burr. It's like a little fluted thing. Cut them out. Let's go right to the middle first and then go to the side. Do not go all the way to the side. You do not want to cut your metal band or you will be making a terrible phone call to the doctor saying you need a new impression and a new band. So, see how that came out? Made a slot in there. I should just break free. Okay, after I get that done, what I do is. So, this is called micro etching. What this does is clean the inside of the band, all my soldering burn marks go away, and all the excess tooth stone particles. And uh, makes it attach better to the tooth, because the glue really sticks to this better. Before, after. The flux makes a uh, kind of a glassy surface on here, and you can steam it off. Okay, there are different ways of doing this. Um, you have a uh, coarse, a finishing rubber wheel, and we like to use these Hatho bristle brushes. And uh, finishing or shining, we use this metal polish with a brush. Just start smoothing, leveling. Blending into the wires. So, like that, and you solder makes all the difference in the world. As smooth as you can get your solder when you're done with the flame, the easier it is with the burrs. Everything 
as smooth as possible. Your main goal with the stone, this is a stone, heatless stone, is to just knock off the excess the stuff that you don't need. Of course you want this to be as comfortable as possible in the mouth. Um, Alright, go to the rubber wheel. Don't go through the band. That's very bad. You already see it starting to shine up for me. Same rubber wheel, just smaller. I can get into the nooks and crannies better. Okay, the half o bristle bristle brushes. Barely say it. Habras disc, and that's what it's called. From Hatho Company. This is 80 grit. It's like a uh, pump. You see how the bristles really smooth out. This is just a bristle brush, so you're going to load some metal polish on here, and then just use this little back and forth method. Go back and forth to this a few times. Oops, wrong side. This also shines up the rest of it. 